Hey YouTube, Big D here again. This is part three of my Noble Victories booster box opening. I'd first like to uh, thank Pokey Collection, Assad, and the SMG Quest Andrew for their support and uh, opening Pokemon packs or keeping the community strong, the Pokemon community, and also everybody else who is trying to keep it strong. Um, I know I grew up with this, with Pokemon cards. I was five years old when they came out, just like a lot of other people. So it brought me back into them. It's been about a year and two months now since I've been recollecting. And before then, I sold all my cards. But in that just short year, I've probably completed about 65% of the English Pokemon cards out so thumbs up to people like them and thank you so next I'd like to say that I've got a Moltres EX from Fire Red and Leaf Green and a Shining Steelix from Neo 4 for sale or trade they are in played condition um that's why I'm not keeping them. I have a mint one of each now. There are no creases in either of them, but they do have edgeware on the back and stuff like that. So I know I'd probably sell those a little cheaper than places like Troll and Toad and stuff. So without further ado, let's get on to finishing this Noble Victories booster box. I've got 10 packs left. And I ended up, didn't know that I misplaced one of the hollows. So I have, I think, eight hollows now and a secret rare. So there's three more total that I'll end up pulling. There was a Terrakion that I had in my reverse hollow pile. I had a hollow under reverse hollow, so I just put it in the wrong place. So, we'll just get right into this. So, the reverse hollow is a Durant, which is uncommon, and a Archieops rare. I'm going to do a recap and at the end of this video too. I've also pulled, I think, seven reverse hollow rares so far. I think it's typical to get ten in a box. Sorry if some of this stuff's hard to read. I get a lot of these cover fossils too. Reverse Pan Seer, which I wanted because it's awesome. And a rare Krygonon Null or whatever. I think that's a duplicate too. And also that Renocul the Renoculuses that I pulled, they were different. I didn't know there were two rare ones. So I thought they were the same one, but I guess not. Starting to think that uh, 
Sweet. I want this one in Halloway, actually. This Victini. It's reverse Halloway. rare. Oh, sweet. The Halloway. Yes. Awesome. This car just looks amazing. And in about a month from now, I'd have to say that uh, most of the hollows should be down to about a buck a piece. A buck or two a piece on eBay. Maybe Troll and Toad, too. Sadly, this is only the third pack that opened nicely. Oh, and I ripped it. That sucks. Wanted to keep it. Damn it. Also, with uh, the SMG quest, check out his channel for sure and Pokey collection, Collections. Make sure, uh, though, because Andrew, the SMG quest, just did 720 booster pack openings all in a single day. He just beat Primetime's record of 540 booster packs by basically, like, 180 packs, which is five booster boxes. So that's awesome. And this is a reverse hollow rare giggle, by the way. And wow, that's really out of focus. And they conkled there. This is a reverse hollow rare. This giggle with one. So there should still be at least one more reverse hollow rare in this set. And the full art and the hollow. And high dragon would be another good hollow to pull. Stockfish is the reverse hollow. I think I pulled that already in this booster box. And that configures. Come on, high dragon. Triple headed dragon piece time. I actually think one of the packs that I opened, the cards were in backwards, which is weird. Dino. Reverse heat more. That's cool. And a behemoth, which is a duplicate, I believe, of one that I've already pulled. Getting the idea that the second to the last pack in the booster box is the uh, full art. It seems like it's that way for some reason on many booster boxes. Which means if I go to a card shop, I'll have them open a new booster box and I'll buy the pack. A Dino, I don't think I pulled that yet. It's weird. Reverse is a trubbish, and that's a duplicate now. Inoculus. So three packs left. Just sad that this is coming to a close so fast.
Arduino. Share another Arduino. Sweet, another X transceiver. Oh yeah, Verizian Hell, Reverse Hell. And there's the Electros I wanted to. Awesome. So no high dragon, Drygen, Driv, whatever the hell it is in this box. But hopefully it'll be in the second box that I buy in about a month. Sweet, reverse hollow on. And a configuris. There's, there's only one out of those. Or if there's only one of those in the, the box, then I have three of that rare, which is odd. And this is the last pack. Full art. Don't know which one. Hoping for like the Kini or something. Yep, that's full art. I can feel it. Back. a little blitzel, crack on and all, swabbling. Sweet, another Rocky helmet. They cockled their rare. Rare reverse. So I think that gives me 11 rare reverses. And you don't want to focus. There you go. And the full art. And the box. And. Awesome. This is one of the more expensive ones. Sweet. So, give me a few seconds to put these in order. Alright, so we'll start with my reverse hell rares. We got Verizian. Victini, uh, Caracasa, it's a cool turtle, but Blastoise is better. Configurus, Ranunculus, Gigalith, Conkledair, Archops, Terrakion, Excalibur, and Cobalion. So I did pull all three beasts reverse hollow. It's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 reverse hollow rares. Which is one more than most boxes get. Um, let's see. I did pull three Eviolites, so two of these will be for sale or trade. Three Ns, four Rocky helmets, and three X transceivers. I think those are all good playable cards. So I'm keeping one of each of those for myself. Reverse Hallows, pulled a bunch. I did get a Reverse Hallow N. And Reverse Hallow X Transceiver. Back there. Oh, and a Reverse Rocky Helmet too. That's cool. Alright, and then I'm not going to show you the rares, but I'll show you the, the hollows. So just let me get the last couple in order. Alright. So, I got Levani Hollow. 
Parisian Hollow, Victini Hollow, the other Victini Hollow, it's awesome. Kyrum Hollow, which I really wanted because it's expensive, so I don't have to buy one. Electros Hollow, I think it looks cool. Trakian Hollow, Landorus Hollow, Bisharp Hollow, Haxorus Hollow, Full Art Verizion, and Full Art M. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. 10 hollows and 2 full arts. So no secret rare, but let's hope for it in the next booster box. Thanks for watching my opening of my, um, whatever it is, Noble Victories Pokemon booster box. And like I said, I've got code cards for sale. There's about 80 here. Um, overall, good booster box. Average, I think, besides a couple of uh, of those playable like trainers, and uh, the three reverse hollow trainers made the box worthwhile because I think those are all like five bucks a piece at least. So for my second booster box, I'm hoping for a hydrate hydrogen hollow, um, cobalion hollow. Reverse Hollow Eviolite. And then a bunch of other stuff I'm missing, like Reverse Hollow Eyes. I should only be missing, I think, like eight cards total from the set. From the regular set. Which are two of the full arts, because I have one incoming. Um, five, four or five hollows. And I think that's it. So, thanks for watching my booster box, guys. Comment, rate, subscribe. Thumbs up. It was a good box. I hope you enjoy. Have a nice afternoon, guys. Bye.